Hi, this is Dr. John Corey in Scottsdale, Arizona. I want to talk to you today about another question I get all the time is, women come in and ask for a very natural result. They want a natural look, they want a teardrop look, um, they want an anatomic look, something that looks more anatomically like a breast. Sometimes women will come in and say, to get that, do I need the anatomic teardrop implant? Um, many times, no. The quick answer is no. Um, I, I lean more towards doing a surgery which I call a natural or an anatomic surgery anyway and you can get that with a regular style implant. This is a regular silicone gel implant. We've been using implants like these for years. This one is by, from Allergan. It's a 371. It's a moderate profile, meaning it's kind of that projection is about in the middle. I can place this in most women in a great location that gives them a very nice teardrop slope and a very natural result. And I can do it with a round implant. So in the majority of cases, I can do an anatomic or a natural or if you want a teardrop type surgery using a regular implant. And you can notice that when the implant is held upside down, it kind of forms a teardrop anyway. Can you see that? Um, other times there, there are certain situations when I actually want the teardrop, teardrop or anatomic implant. You can see this one has a more teardrop shape, a little more anatomic like a breast, very different than this one here. But in some cases, I need the implant to help give me the anatomic teardrop result. Uh, those situations might be someone who is very thin. It might be someone who is, I might go above the muscle in some women. Um, there are situations when really the implant is going to help give me that. So overall, if you're, if you're looking for a natural teardrop um, anatomic result, most of the time, we surgeons can get that with the, even with this round implant depending on how the surgery is done. Every once in a while, we need the actual teardrop implant. Thanks. This has been Dr. John Corey in Scottsdale, Arizona.